Hi guys, it's Tenille from Paper Milkshake and welcome back to my channel. I am going to be very, very quiet because everyone in my house is asleep right now, including my husband. I have just come back from a four day holiday to Byron Bay, beautiful Byron Bay, which was meant to be a work trip that has turned into a little holiday because the work trip got cancelled due to coronavirus, our dear friend coronavirus. <laughs> uh, but not to worry, I'm, I'm really glad to be home and I had a fantastic holiday. And while I was gone, the lovely um, Olga Astassi Scrappers Express posted some beautiful paper from the brand new Sweet Story collection from Maggie Holmes. So I'm just jumping on here to show you what she has sent me. Um, so Olga, as always, just so generously sent me um, a little gift. So um, Olga has sent me this beautiful Remarks Dimensional sticker and I have had this before and I absolutely love them. I've made huge embellishments with that gorgeous heart and this diamond and I'm very grateful, very grateful to Olga for sending this to me because I will definitely be using them and I really, really like them. So thank you, Olga. Let's jump straight into the Sweet Story collection. Now, I have only got the papers because Sassy Scrappers has only got the papers so far. I don't believe anywhere um, globally at the moment, um, I don't believe anywhere have stock of the um, Sweet Story embellishments or stickers or anything else because American Crafts just hasn't got it like they just haven't been sending them out because i think because of the whole coronavirus issue i dare say that the stickers and chipboards and embellishments are probably all stuck in a warehouse in china somewhere that's just my speculation so here we are um we have this gorgeous beautiful like vellum with a gold foiling on it from sweet story and it's just stunning i am really enjoying all the vellum pieces that are coming out with the um, American Crafts Maggie Holmes collections. Um, this seems like an odd choice flowers for Sweet Story. However, um, I bought I bought three sheets. Now, these were all bought with my own money from Olga. Um, I, I said to Olga, I'd like to buy my own papers first and have a play with them, see what I like, and then um, she'll send it out to me as part of the design team um, pack once I've chosen which ones I like. So um, I have bought multiples of each of these papers but I will show them to you one by one. So this should be a pretty detailed walkthrough of each of the papers. Now this one is called Sweet Treat. I mean you guys know me so well of course I'm going to buy the cut aparts from this collection. Why wouldn't I? And these colors are so much more vibrant than what I thought they would be. Um, online, it looks like a very neutral kind of um, maybe muted palette, but it is actually quite bright and pretty. Not so mustardy and dull like Willa Lane, for example. It's definitely a lot more vibrant. And look at that beautiful pink polka dot on the back. Wow, I'm really going to have problems with this cut apart because I'm not going to know whether I want to use the cut apart or that beautiful pink on the back. And this says, you make every day infinitely sweet. Oh, how beautiful, what a gorgeous message. And it wouldn't be crepe paper if we didn't have any swans, butterflies or flowers. Just quintessentially crepe paper. So I bought three of them. Look at this gorgeous design. I absolutely love it. This one's called Smitten. And we've got this beautiful, like, like a schnauzer dog set amongst these flowers. And it's on a very pale pink background and it is gorgeous. How stunning is that? And the back of that has this beautiful, like, mustard yellow printed background very very cute 
I am loving the designs in the Sweet Story collection. Look at this beautiful paper with the hot air balloons. Look at that. And just a plain grid paper in the back, which I always appreciate. But these will be so fun to fussy cut, guys. Oh, so pretty. After that, um, we saw this kind of rainbow design in the uh, Magical Forest collection. But this is a lot more sugary, I'd say. This colour is a lot more sugary in the Sweet Story, this, this rainbow paper. And I'm loving, um, I'm loving the crepe paper rainbow design. And there's this like washi tape star pattern on the back. So pretty. All of them are so pretty. Then this one is called Rhyme. And on Rhyme, we've got numbers on one side. And oh my gosh, some beautiful sherbet flowers on the back. Look at those clusters. The moment I laid my eyes on Sweet Story online, I was smitten. I was absolutely in love. And of course, I'm even more in love with it now, seeing it in real life. Oh, look at this one. This one's called Sprinkles, and it's so gorgeous. So many beautiful, like, multicolour semicircles. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. This one is a swan pattern amongst pink. This is beautiful. And this swan paper is so pretty. It's on this beautiful pink background with this like gorgeous sketched swans with the hearts and the flowers and it's so pretty and it's got a beautiful like diamonds um like pattern on the back which i really like oh i love this one this beautiful tiger with the floral wreath around his neck so cute and on the back of that we've got black and white hearts so so pretty After that, we've got a very fruity paper, and this one reminds you of Kiki K a lot. And Kiki K and a beautiful rainbow pattern behind it. Okay, and the next piece is this beautiful, beautiful yellow flower, which is not too different to the beautiful, like, peony, similar peony from Sunny Days. And that gorgeous note paper. Love note paper patterns. And then lastly, it's this beautiful, like, like frames that look like they're made out of washi tape. And on the back of that, this beautiful pattern paper. And the second cut apart from the collection is this one that looks like a whole bunch of Polaroids. And it's so summery and so sweet. And this one is called Confection. I've got the strawberries. This one that says, hello, lovely. And this one looks like um, film paper. Really beautiful. Of course you can. There you go, Clara. What do you think? What do you see? Um, strawberries. Strawberries. Yeah, what else do you see? I see ducky. You see a ducky? It's very similar to a ducky. It's called a swan. It's a ducky. Okay, it's a ducky. Oh, I didn't realize the back sheet the b side of the cutter part is so beautiful look at those gorgeous sentiments on there yeah i'm gonna show you this unicorn clara look how beautiful that horsey is where's the doggy i don't think that's a doggy clara i think that's a little horsey gorgeous gorgeous paper oh and look at this this one's called sparkle and it's just confetti beautiful confetti on the tiffany seafoam blue background you can there you go and this beautiful pattern flower paper on the back how beautiful did you see the doggy clara oh and probably one of my favorite patterns this one is very similar to the bow pattern paper that came with the um the crepe paper heritage maggie holmes heritage collection but this is like the summer fun colorful twist to it and it's called ponytail stunning and 
Okay, this one reminds me of Hooray, this beautiful grid paper on the back. Then we have this one. Yeah, I feel okay about it. It's called the it's called Sweetest, and this one has um, I guess it's got a similar theme to it to one of the pattern papers from Carousel. And oh I like that. Definitely like the back of that. Beautiful sherbet pink pattern. Diamonds on the back. Then we have this beautiful like spots paper. It's called Soft Serve and it's this salmon pink and bubblegum pink. So beautiful. I would love some magic, Camellia. Okay. Oh, look at this one. It's called Glee. What do you what do you say when you go when you do magic? <laughs> yes. Oh, there's your magic. Beautiful. Look at that gorgeous blue. This is a beautiful collection, guys. Absolutely loving it. And here is kind of like a mix of all the icons. We've got the tiger, we've got that little doggy, the hot air balloons and swans. And then they've she's added like the butterfly and the giraffe. Absolutely beautiful. This one's called Story Time. Black and white on the back. We're almost done. We've got this one, which has got a very pale pink background and lots of very special words on it. Oh, look at the blueberries on the back. Absolutely stunning collection. I'm so in love with it, guys, and I cannot wait to play with it. This one's called Fresh and it's green. It's very, very green. And that beautiful pink and white on the back. Oh my god, you guys. This collection is so delicious. This one's called Pink Truffle. And it's another floral. And oh, look at the pink swans on the back. What a stunning collection. And look, shortcake. This paper called shortcake is just a bunch of strawberries. Oh, how beautiful. That's all of it, guys. I'm looking forward to playing with this collection. I mean, all I've got, as I said, are the papers for now, so I'm not sure whether I'm going to start playing with it or whether I'm going to wait for the rest of the embellishments to arrive. Um, either way, this is set to be an absolutely stunning, stunning collection and I'm really, really looking forward to playing with it. I can certainly be playing with this as part of my cut apart challenge. And there's just a whole bunch of beautiful designs to play with. So thank you guys for sharing this journey with me. Thank you for watching my video. If you like this video, please like and subscribe and I'll see you in my next one. Bye guys.